All right, everyone. So welcome back to part two of my mystery box from Pout Fritch and Tarantulas unboxing. If you have not seen part one, hit the back button right now. Go back and do that. And then come back and watch this one for the rest of you. Here we go. This is number three of four tarantula slings that we got. Next up, I'm going to do... Now we're into the terrestrials. So maybe they'll be a little slower. This is the Pamphibidius species platyoma. If I can hold on to this damn label. Um, I'm familiar with them. I don't know a hell of a lot about them. I know that with the Pamphibidia species, a lot of times the um, males tend to be more beautiful than the females or vice versa. I don't really know. Like I said, I don't know a hell of a lot about them. So there it is down in there. You can kind of see its little legs. So let's see if we can get this little guy out. I am telling you, this tissue sometimes just really wants to hold inside that tube. Fortunately, this little guy is close to the bottom, so I know that... Sorry, guys, I'm out of the shot there. Kind of concentrating more on what I'm doing than the camera itself. I know most all of you out there who keep tarantulas have dealt with pelt friction tarantulas and I know several people personally that are actually friends of mine that say that that they are their go-to or um, the only ones that they'll buy from. Now, of course, there are many good uh, online sellers, vendors out there, but I've got to say that Pop Friction is one of the best. Um, the couple, Jared and Allie, of course, are super awesome to deal with, which is one of the reasons why they are some of the best out there, but also um, their selection and their prices and the fact that you get a freebie on any order over $50. Wow, look how beautiful that is. You get a freebie for any order over $50. And, you know, most sites have a minimum purchase of $50 before they'll ship. They actually do not have that. You could spend $35 on a tarantula and they'll ship it to you if you want. But if you're smart, of course, you'll spend more than $50 so that you get a freebie. Wow, guys. It is a beautiful little sling. Again, any information on these guys will be greatly appreciated. And all of these will be rehoused into proper enclosures tomorrow after I've had time to do a little research and know kind of how to set them up. But, man, that's a beautiful sling right there. Okay, guys, let's move on to the last one. Okay, and last but not least is the... The... O species blue panay. I'm not sure... But I believe that is the Orphanacus, Orphanaceous, something like that. Um, I believe it's an old world and possibly a fossorial, but I don't know that for sure. We'll find out later and relay that information to you in the rehousings. But if someone does have these and knows a bit about them, please feel free to share it. So let's go ahead and get this last sling out of here. Because it's been a long day for me, and it's about time to get ready to go to bed. Because, of course, I have to go back to work again tomorrow. And there it is, down in there. Hanging out in the bottom. I believe that's its little booty staring at us there. So let's get it out and see what we got here, what it looks like and everything. Try to do more of this in frame this time. Kind of so you, you can see it. A lot of times I spend too much time looking beyond the camera. And I don't get 
some of this stuff in frame. And you guys are probably like, what the hell? But I think we all make those mistakes. Especially when it comes to unboxings and stuff. You really want to concentrate on what the heck you're doing. Definitely want to be careful. And you don't want anybody escaping and running running around. And all that good stuff. You always want all of your unboxings to kind of go nice and smooth, of course. I probably should have employed another pair of tweezers on this thing but like I said this is all just kind of uh, sudden and brief because it's been a long day and haven't had a whole lot of time to put this together so here we go let's see if we can get a look at it and there it is It's already looking like it's got a bit of a metallic blue sheen to it. Let's see if we can transfer this little guy down into this deli cup without too many issues. And then we will end this video. And then we will rehouse them later on. Alrighty. So there it is, out and into its deli cup. There it is. The O species blue panay, which I like I said, I believe is the Orphanacus or Orphanaceous, or whatever, but I'm not completely certain, so I will look that up and relay this information to you in the next video. Hey guys, that is the end of this unboxing. I really hope that you enjoyed it. Please go check out Pop Friction Tarantulas, guys, because they are freaking awesome. This little hiccup with them is not going to stop me from buying from them again. So, again, like I said, just please go check them out because they are super awesome people to deal with. They got badass tarantulas, good prices, and you get a freebie if you spend $50. It's automatic. So, go check them out, guys. I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, please give me a thumbs up and a comment. Don't forget to subscribe if you have not done that. Share this video with your family, your friends, and guys, let's take care of ourselves and each other. Hope you all have a great night. Take care, and God bless.